ABC 15 exclusive on a valley boy who died in foster care. We now know the attempt to get the injured toddler help may have happened by chance. ABC 15's Angie Cayley has been working this story all day and explains why no one called 911. They called him Sam Bam. The precocious three year old loved his siblings, but tonight his death while in a foster home is under investigation, especially leaving him in the hands of CPS and everything and knowing, hoping your child to be safe. It's unclear what caused the injuries that killed Samuel Brummett Jr. But what is clear is that he may not have been taken to the hospital if paramedics weren't already in his Whitman neighborhood. According to MCSO, it was April 30th when EMTs were on an unrelated call on Mellow Drive and were flagged down for an injured child. They say he was immediately flown to Phoenix Children's Hospital in severe condition. So who knows how long he was suffering? The boy's mother says she wasn't notified he was in the hospital until a day after he was admitted. He didn't live with her because he was taken away in April after allegations of neglect. They were family friends and I felt that they would be safe there, you know, because I as a mother, I would have never left my children if I never, never felt safe for my children to be there. Samuel died on May 2nd. The state keeps an online list of child fatalities and near fatalities from abuse or neglect. There have been at least six incidents this year. Samuel's is not listed. However, police have not filed charges against anyone in his death and at this point are only calling it suspicious. Angie Cayley, ABC 15, Arizona.